Imagine if I was Dragonborn. The term shouting would take on an entirely new meaning. Yeah, shut up! Hi all, and welcome back to our Skyrim Let's Play Path of Balthasar the Great. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Well, as you can see, I'm uh, wearing uh, two new things. A new hood and a uh, new pair of boots. I have figured out why my game was crashing all the time. Well, not all the time, but very much so. Um, as you can see, the armor that um, Sophia has on here, the... Um, uh, no, I'm not sure if we have that under mod configurations. Uh, nope, we don't. Um, yeah, no, um, yeah, let me just, um, the dark, the, this one, the dark brotherhood armor, uh, the special, uh, quest line that you can g do to get this, uh, special, uh, special armor here. Uh, I don't think it's the Dark Brotherhood. It's 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 another mod. Uh, it's called a Phoenix or something like that. I, I can't can't remember. But this mod, um, yeah, uh, the armor of this mod coll uh, collides with uh, uh, another mo uh, mod that I've got on, uh, which has the same type of armor, but uh, yeah, uh, tweaks it just a little bit. Uh, it uh, enhances the effect of the armor and stuff like that. Cause this is the Dark Brotherhood armor. Don't get me wrong, uh, it's a cool, it's the cool special armor that you get from joining the uh, the Dark Brotherhood and becoming uh, a high league member of them. Uh, where this one uh, just has this uh, uh, special, uh, yeah, enchantment on it. So, uh, hence why I got a new hood and new uh, boots, because I had in my inventory. Uh, every time uh, I was uh, going to look into an inventory, my game crashed because I had in my inventory boots and uh, hood that resembled the one uh, th that of the armor, and so they didn't like each other very much. Hence, why I've got a new hood and new boots. If I don't have the armor that it clashes with on me. Uh, uh, it doesn't. Uh, I can uh, I can look in the inventory, loot the armor, but if I look in the inventory again, it crashes. So I just keep, uh, just got to uh, hold an eye out for that. But uh, yeah, by uh, putting out the hood and the boots, I actually gained a, m a little bit more exposure. For some, exposure thirteen, meaning that um, well minus thirteen. Meaning that uh, it has, to, I have to gain an ex gain a net exposure above thirteen before I actually begin to get cold. So yeah, and also we need to um, we need to find a couple of new kids because this house is getting a little bit too uh, yeah uh, dreary. Not having kids in here. But uh, I'm thinking of waiting off a little bit on that because I want. I want to uh, look around and see if I can't find someone that has um, uh, used this mod with this house in solitude. Um, oh yeah, let me just, I can just go over here and warm myself by the fire. Okay, I'm already completely warmed up. This, <laughs> it is in here is completely warm. Yeah, who's used this mod, uh, mod uh, to uh, enhance some kids and stuff like that, because that could be cool. So yeah. So the, it didn't do what uh, Lucia did, walking into the wall all the time and glitching out in uh, the statue's uh, place. I, th I, th <laughs> I think the main reason was I killed that crab. Uh, I killed a crab that the kid had. And uh, yeah, he was like, I'm never going to talk to you again. And they were glitched inside the um, the statues and they were, uh, they were just stagnant. They didn't move. Only when I clicked on on them, they looked at me and so were. Good with conjuration. Okay. Yeah. Why don't you conjure up a pink mammoth wearing a hat? <sighs> you can do that. What would use is that then? Oh my god. Okay. So many things we can do. Oh well. 
most of them are just mods that has uh, unlocked them, unlocked the skill. Okay, cool. What is our agenda? Um, I'm going to continue on our uh, so-called yeah, meet Dolphin in Riverwood, return the horn. Yeah, let's uh, go and return the horn. Okay, I'm, uh, I'm, uh, uh, I want to see how much cold and bitterness... Ew! It's raining. Ugh. All the way up here on the throat of the mountain. On the throat of the world. Oh. Move it. Right here. Hi, Rothgar. I want to see how, uh, how fast my... Uh, uh, yeah. How you doing, Hussy? Oh my god, it's a dark, deep blue. Oh, look at that. My exposure level just went from completely full to crooky f Damn. Let's get our asses inside. <laughs> Rough car here. Whew. Retrieve the horn of Jorgen Rimkov. Yeah. Well done. You have now passed all the trials. Come with me. It is time for us to recognize you formally as Dragonborn. Okay. I get the, uh, the dar in my fruits row. Da. <laughs> you are ready to learn the final word of unrelenting force. Da. Which means push. Da. With all three words together, this shout is much more powerful. Use it wisely. Master Wolfgar will now gift you with his knowledge of Da. You have completed your training, Dragonborn. We would speak to you. Stand between us and prepare yourself. Few can withstand the unbridled voice of the Greybeard. Do you know what I love to do when I have a little too much spare gold? I find a beggar and pay them to harass people. They are so desperate for money that they will do almost anything. It can be very entertaining to watch. Dovahkiin, you have tasted the voice of the Greybeards and passed through unscathed. Hi, Hrothgar is open to you. Cool. Okay, let me just see here. First brother! Yay! Okay. Now that we've gotten that out of the way, let's go to Delphine. Delphine? 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 Whoa, it is night as hell. Hmm, where is it? Yeah, I was just like, what? Vampire Lord should start with a powerful drain life spell. I knew it. Oh, 
Whatever you need. My smear if it's simple and strong. I can forge it. Nice. Yeah, that's right after. Uh... Yeah, this is also one of the mods that uh, makes out these new hats. Uh, which uh, apparently doesn't like. Uh... He's been in stealing this. <laughs> You're doing that for. I don't want him to uh, just lay about. There you go. Yes. No. Okay, vampire dust. Yeah, I might be able to use some of these. There you go. It was dolphins we need to go to. Hello, Sven. I think he's Swedish. Yeah, he's he's probably Swedish. I don't think you were followed. Come on, I have a plan. What's up? I figured out how we're going to get you into the Thalmor Embassy. Oh, by uh, your little walk over here? You're not coming? That didn't take I've long. I've been doing this a long time, remember? While the Thalmor have been looking for me, I've been watching them. Cool. The Thalmor Ambassador, Ellen Wimp, regularly throws parties where the rich and connected cozy up to the Thalmor. I can get you into one of those parties. Once you're inside the embassy, you can get away and find Ellen Wen's secret files. I have a contact inside the embassy. He's not up for this kind of high-risk mission, but he can help you. His name is Malborn. Wood Elf. Plenty of reason to hate the Thalmor. You can trust him. I'll get word for him to meet you in solitude at the Winking Skeever. You know it? Yeah, I do. While you're doing that, I'll work on getting you an invitation to Ellen Wen's little party. Cool. Meet me at the Solitude Stables after you've arranged things with Melbourne. Any questions? Nope. Uh... Nope, yeah. Sounds good. Be careful. Cool. Uh... I steal everything we could get our filthy little grubby hands on here, almost. <laughs> That's empty. I was hurt. Ooh. Give me, give me. I love ingredients. Right here. Storm Atronach. More money. Blade sword. A sword of the blades. Cool. Well, that was that. And she's got money purses all over the place. Ooh, food. Love me some food. Ooh, the heck. <laughs> I had heard you died. Harvard? Damn, that was from Helgen. Yeesh. Yeah, how you doing, boy? Yeah, uh, give me just a second, I'll be right back. And we are back, yeah. Uh, we are here with Melbourne. Uh, yeah, we're gonna... Yes? Talk to him. Our mutual friends sent me. Really? You're who she picked? I hope she knows what she's doing. Here's the deal. I can smuggle some equipment into the embassy for you. Don't plan on bringing anything else in with you. Okay. Thalmor takes security very seriously. <clears throat> Give me what you can't live without, and I'll make sure to get it into the embassy. Okay. Rest is up to you. Yes. Uh, what are we? Uh, hold on. 
I need. I'm ready. Here's what I'll need. Okay. I'll get this inside the embassy for you. I've got to go. I'll find you at the party. Don't, I don't worry. I don't need any of the weapons, but I do need. I need the satchel. The armor. The hood. Mm, this one. This one. And let me see here. Speechcraft. We don't need speechcraft. We need. That. There's a racing skill we don't need. Shot. Oh, quest items. Whoa, what? Okay, cool. Okay, that one we also need. Uh, yeah. That one. And also, where's our sneak? I'm pretty sure we have a sneak ring. Don't we? Uh. Yeah, uh, I was trying to... Uh, I'm not... Uh, it's, this thing is a little bit too uh, overpowered, so I'm not going to use it. But I was going to try to see if I could uh, disenchant it. But I can't already have that particular disenchantment or enchantment. Increase skill and increase magic uh, regeneration faster. Uh, yeah. Armor rate increased by 20. Yeah, we need that one too. Uh, let's take those two with us as well. That one would be a good thing to have. I can't do that one. Restoration skill I can't do either. Stamina, speechcraft, that's it. Uh, wait a minute, what about some... Okay... I think I'm gonna take my... Yeah. I'm gonna give him all of these, all nine. And of course these... Bam. And of course this one. Yeah. Nothing else, right? Nope, nothing else matters. And there we go. He is there, walking away with my stuff. And I've just taken the liberty of uh, putting on some uh, regular fine clothes here. Um, yeah. <clears throat> I hope, let's hope it works this time. Mm. I've also, uh, uh, taken, uh, taken the liberty <laughs> of, uh... Oh, eyes open. Damn dragons could swoop down at any time. Yeah. That's Sophia's horse, yeah. You stay here and wait for your master. So, yeah, um... I've taken, uh, uh, instead of uh, having, whoop, okay, seems like everything I do works. You can see here, I've only 11 carry weight, armor rating minus 12, damn. But yeah, um, uh, these things, these armor uh, pendants of talus, I can't, uh, apparently I can't give away because they are quest items. This is also a quest item. I forgot to put the food away and the ingredients. Uh, these are quest items. And these are quest items. So, yeah. Let's just head down to... Uh, Yeah, I've uh, read up a little bit about the exposure level and stuff like that. When it says up there, it says plus 14 and goes down. Yeah, that's not what you want. You 
someone to smuggle into the embassy? Good. I have your invitation to the party. But the only way you're going to get past the guards is if they really believe you're an invited guest. Which means you need to look the part and not be armed to the teeth. Here, put this on. When you're ready, I'll keep the rest of your gear safe until you get back. You'll only have what Malborn smuggled in for you, plus whatever you can pick up inside. You can't go to a party at the Thalmor Embassy. Okay. I have to put on these two, apparently. Like that. I guess that will have to do. You should pass for a real guest, at least until you open your mouth. Ready to board the carriage to the embassy? I'm ready. Don't worry, it will all be waiting for you when you get back. Just make sure you get back out of there alive with the information we need. Good luck. And we're off. So far so good, no crashes. No. Ah, a fellow latecomer to Ellenwyn's little soiree. Yeah. And arriving by carriage, no less. I salute you, sir. My lateness is due more to getting lost on the way up this God's forsaken mountain than to any desire to actually arrive late. I prefer to arrive early, often the day before the party, so as not to miss out on any of the drinking. Please, you first. I insist. There's not enough drinking in the world today, wouldn't you agree? Yeah. Welcome to the Thalmor Embassy. Your invitation, please. Damn, you look ugly. Thank you, sir. Go right in. Now then, here's my invitation. I don't have a poison dagger strapped to my thigh, etc. Et I'm just doing. Please proceed into the embassy. Everything's in order. Welcome. Okay. Come on, you can do it. Welcome. I don't believe we've met. I am Ellenwyn, the Thalmor ambassador to Skyrim. And you are? My name is Balthazar Blake. Pleased to meet you. Ah, yes. I remember your name from the guest list. Please, tell me more about yourself. What brings you to this... to Skyrim? What is it, Malborn? It's just that we've no run out of the Alco wine. Crops that grow there Do never I have your permission to uncork the... Of course. I've told you before not to bother me with such trifles. Yes, Madam Ambassador. My apologies. We'll have to get better acquainted later. Please, enjoy yourself. Thank you. I will crash this party. What can I get for you? You made it in. Good. As soon as you distract the guards, I'll open this door and we can get you on your way. Let's hope we both live through this day. Cool. Uh, I'll have a... I'll like a drink. There you go, sir. The finest Colobian brandy. Is there anything else I can get for you? Mm-hmm. Till next time. What a lovely party. Ellen went always Girls. throws quite a party. I never miss one if I can help it. I heard Ellen say she's going to open a bottle of her best firebrand wine later. I can hardly wait. Ellen went always throws quite a party. I never miss one if I can help it. Mm-hmm. Hey! What do you need to do to get a drink around here? Ah, the one generous soul amongst a gathering of pinch pennies and lick spittles! <laughs> if there's anything I can ever do for you, do not hesitate to call upon me. Well, thanks. I want to know. Actually, there is something you could help me out with. Wonderful. I can begin to repay your generosity immediately. Say on, friend. I need you to cause a scene. Get everyone's attention for a few minutes. Is that all? My friend, you've come to the right person. You could say that causing a scene is somewhat of a specialty of mine. Stand back and behold my handiwork.
Attention, everyone. Could I have your attention, please? I have an announcement to make. I propose a toast to Ellen Wynn, our that? mistress. What are you I doing? speak figuratively. Let's go. Let's go. Nothing Before anyone notices us. Likely than that someone would actually want her in their bed. Although most of you are already in bed with her. But again, I speak. <laughs> so far, so good. Let's hope nobody saw us slip out. We need to pass through the kitchen. Your gear is hidden in the larder. Just stay close and let me do any talking. Got it? Okay. Follow me. Someone bring me a drink, quick. Who comes, Malvern? You know I don't like strange smells in my kitchen. A guest feeling ill. Leave the poor wretch be. A guest? In the kitchens? You know this is against the rules. Rules, is it, Zavani? I didn't realize that eating moon sugar was permitted. Perhaps I should ask the ambassador. Get out of here. I saw nothing. Your gear is in that chest. I'll lock the door behind you. Don't screw this up. Breathe up. Hmm, there's something wrong here. Oh, that's right. For safety reasons, I um, I didn't take my um, um, yeah, special armor with me, which probably was a good thing because I should have here, yeah, invisibility. We got forty seconds and thirty seconds. So we should be Back before I missed. Should be okay. He's looking right at me and nobody sees me. Come on. If someone misses me at the party, we're both dead. Okay. Good Did luck. you see those robes You're on your own this now. morning? Who are they with? More of what the emissaries cheating in forces. <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> Oh, look at that. He's got some cool eyes. Okay. Hence why we took the potion with us. Oh my god. Uh, yeah, for 600 seconds, that sounds like a good deal. And I should have plenty of healing potions. And maybe some magical potions as well. Apparently, my sneak ability is somewhat lacking. <laughs> Left eye. Like, it looks pretty cool. Okay. You know what? Let's take this one. It would give me a little bit of an advantage instead of the. The equipment provided standard exposure level, yeah. Let us just... Hmm... What kind of ropes are these? Destructions level 12, nice. Look at the helmet on this guy. <laughs> A 
Nice saber. Okay, he's a bit uh, light on his feet, this guy. Okay. But I think the rest of it we are going to have to wait for another episode. So yeah, thank you all so very much for watching. And as always, catch on the flip side.